Welcome to our cooking show. Today we will, we will make banana splits. We're out of bananas. So we're gonna go with a hot dog split. So let's go with some mustard. Well, relish. And tomato ketchup. Let's put some wasabi on the side. Strawberry syrup. Some mayonnaise and cheese. Some soda. It's not frozen. Can't have a split without ice cream, which we're almost out of. And the most important part, the bun. I'm going to be making the hot dog sundae or the banana split but we're out of banana hot dog sundae if that's what you like to call it. So first, I'm going to get a hot dog bun. Got to make sure they are expired by at least two years, which these are. So open this up, put in an also expired hot dog. And we're gonna start with the raspberry sherbet, since this, the main part is ice cream. Okay, so we're gonna make some of this. There's the ice cream. And just let's put some mayonnaise for extra flavor. It's gonna make it taste very good. It's gonna be perfect dessert for all you people who like hot dog desserts. Gonna put some mustard. The next is ketchup. Oh, gross. That's very well on the hot dog. This slice of American cheese. There, we put that on. And now for some strawberry syrup. This will give it a very good ice creamy flavor. And some people like well, wasabi on their hot dogs, so I'm gonna put that on for those people. Wasabi makes it very hot and yeah. So I put on put it on in globs. Just just cuz for the fun of it, and you know. And that is our hot dog sundae. So now we're back. It's the final time of making your um, hot dog sundae. So we've already done the prep and the actual making. Now we just have to cook it. You could cook it in an oven, but we like to use our microwaves here. So, oh, well there's something already in the microwave, but that's okay. You could put, just put it in there and I would nuke it for about 20 seconds, two minutes, either way, it doesn't really matter. Basically, you want the cheese to get all melted in there. You might think, well, the ice cream's gonna melt. Well, exactly. It's gonna get into the bread, make it all nice, so it's gonna be exactly like your banana split. So, um, I don't really know. Let's see, oh, delicious. You could smell the wasabi and the mustard seed and then the raspberry. So now you just need your last step which is to fold it all over. You could have it open face, as some people like, but I like to fold it all inside so everything gets together. Oh, and then you're just gonna get like, like, like that. Yep, and that is your average summer's day banana split. Mmm, delicious! Wow!
Blah! 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 Blah!